are the Florida Panthers unstoppable? Last night was Game 2 of the Eastern Conference Final between the Florida Panthers and the Carolina Hurricanes, and it was an extremely tight game all the way to the end. The first period would see the Carolina Hurricanes absolutely outplay the Panthers. At one point in the period, the shots were 13-1 to in favor of Carolina. The Hurricanes came out of the gate flying after their loss in Game 1. Unfortunately, from all this pressure, it would only lead to one goal, and it was scored by the defenseman Chatfield, and it was two minutes into the period. Going into the second, the Panthers had a great pushback, nearly equalizing the shots. This pushback would lead to a goal by Alexander Barkov, which, by the way, was an absolutely disgusting goal halfway through the period. I swear, this guy has absolutely perfected the fake between the legs goal. For the second game in a row, this game was going to overtime. Although, this one did not need four overtimes to finish, like in game one. But, it was the same overtime hero as game one. Matthew Kachuk would score, once again, two minutes into overtime to win the game. This goal now makes Matthew Kachuk only one of three players in NHL history to score an overtime goal in each of the first two games of a playoff series. Look, the Florida Panthers coming into the playoffs as an eighth seed barely squeezing their way in, now have a two-game lead in the Eastern Conference Finals. To be honest, I don't see them losing to Carolina. The way this team is playing right now is just insane. Backstop by the reincarnation of Jesus himself and Sergei Bobrovsky, and players like Kachuk and Verhage constantly coming in clutch, they're going to be a hard team to beat. This goes without even mentioning their amazing team play, and the system they are using is working and it is completely shutting teams down. First Boston, then the Leafs, and now the Hurricanes. This team is not allowing any chances at all. I would love to see the Panthers win. A good Cinderella story is always awesome. In my next video, I think I might talk about early Conn Smythe winners for every team. So let me know in the comments, one player from each remaining team, who you think deserves the Conn Smythe. And with that being said, this is Gus, signing out.